Lads, it's been a while since I've done a video like this on the road to glory. This is essentially going to be like a little bit of an update as to what I've been doing on the From Scratch accounts, but also mainly focused on packs for the new promo. Hey, if you boys enjoyed this video, it would be greatly appreciated if you could drop a like and make sure to subscribe channel if you want you. In this video, I am going to be opening up my 83 times 25 packs and doing SBC content and other pack content as well. So a wide range of things that hopefully you guys will find entertaining. Anyway, though, let's go check out this new promo, see which items we could pack and then jump into jump into the store and see what we're going to get. Right, this is what we've got for Centurion's Team 1. Kim Pembe is going to be insane. Um, in there as well, we do have Ben Yedder and Neymar. Other than that, a lot of like distinctly average cards. But you know what? That could be good for sniping. So maybe. I'm not sure. I'm not going to guarantee this. I want to do a lot of pack content. But maybe we'll actually try out some sniping filters as well for this new promo. Right, lads. I've actually got a bunch of really good packs saved up. And I'm going to open all of them for this promotion because there's also SBC content that I want to do. Um, I'm going to cut it up into highlights. I'm not going to show you every single one. Just when we get like big walkouts or promo cards. So let's jump into this and hopefully get some decent items. I get a walkout in the first pack. That's insane. Well, we know it can't be. We know it couldn't have been Neymar as he's currently a Centurion, but... Let's have a look. I think this card actually might be a duplicate, so I'm going to have to recycle him straight away. 84 rated card as well as one of the other rare items. But that's actually not a bad pack considering it's technically one of the worst ones. Surely something big from this. Go on then, give me a cheeky inform. That's actually not bad. That's actually pretty decent. A position change, Luke Shaw. It does count as walkouts. There could be other cards in here as well. I don't know what he's worth. Chat, does anyone know how much this card's actually worth? And the Frankie Deong. Brilliant pack for Fodder. Even though this Luke Shaw is probably better than Fodder in all fairness. That's actually pretty nice though. I'll take that one. One of our better packs so far. Walkout, here we go. Nationality's key. Go on then. Do you imagine if it is Mbappe? <laughs> if only. Oh, mate. Still hunting for a Killian Mbappe on, uh, on the RTG. That'd be such a game changer for my squad. We'll take it though, boys. An 86 and an 84 with quite a few 83s as well. Decent pack, actually. Not bad for the Walk out from this. Let's go, man. Centre back, I read it. It's always Ruben Diaz, eh? But I am happy with the fodder, boys. Like, it ain't exciting. There's no promo cards yet. But the thing is, this is just going to lead up to an icon player pick. Which hopefully will be good for the RTG accounts. Maybe I'll try it. Maybe I'll try it after I've done this. Here we go, walkouts. We'll take it, we will take it. 89 overall, you'd love to see that. And this isn't even the main packs yet. We've still got the 83 times 25 to come. So the fact that I've not hit promo, a little bit disappointing, but the fact that this is just from... Oh my God, Oblak and Thiago Silva, two walkouts. Couple of 84s as well. Mate, I'm really hoping now that we just hit like, do you know from the, from the main packs? Maybe like a couple of promos or a big hero. Can you get heroes from them? I'm not sure. But this is really nice fodder so far. Again, another walkout. These are actually cracked, mate. Goalkeeper galore. But the thing is, though, for fodder, these guys are so good. High rated items like to Stegen, 88 overall. Absolutely love that. Again, if we could get multiple items from this, that'd be sick. Tiago, perfect. I'm legit getting really nice fodder. And that is actually what I want. To lead up to like SBC content later on the video. Again, walkouts. Come on. Big would be nice. Brazilian. Allison. Tie rated 89 overall. Love that. Love that. Let's see what other cards are going to get inside of it. Just 84s again though. Is that going to be tradable? It's not. Right. We'll, we'll recycle and um, come back to the other big packs in a second. I didn't think this through. Um, I just recycled Jekko into the icon pick but it now means that i have to open this before i can move into the store pack so let's check out what we're gonna get if you guys done one of these let me know in the comment section down below what players did you pack canavaro was the item that i took in the previous one i think from this i need to go with didier drogba um he's actually a, a quite meta card to be honest with you on fifa 23 so 
Out of those selections, he's definitely the one. He's four-star, four-star. High attack and high defensive work rates. It's not terrible. I might actually try him out in my team, to be honest. Right then, lads, these are the big ones. 83 plus times 25, and we do have three of these to open. I'm looking for the new promo cards. That's what I want. A Brazilian nationality on the boards would be insane. It's going to be a team of the week. This might take priority, though. I'm thinking this might take priority. It probably does, right? Over Centurions. So Centurions could be in the pack. It's technically a walkout. Le Font, but it's not a great one. French could have been Griezmann. I'm hoping to see big ratings. A couple of 89s. An 87, an 86, a few 85s, two Team of the Week cards. Are we going to see, are we going to get Centurions on the next page? We don't. We don't hit a Centurion, a bunch of 83s as well, obviously. Going to have to recycle some of these into something. No promo cards yet, though. Next one then, boys. I am putting the fodder into Mores. That's going to be a new card that I use on the RTG. I'm just looking for promo, but I don't think it's going to pop. Would it take priority over a gold? It must do, though, right? You'd expect it to... You'd, yeah, you'd think it'd take priority over a gold, right? I'm not even getting, like, low-rated 85-rated promo cards. I can't complain, though. Like, the, the cards that I'm getting are pretty insane, right? I'm getting so many walkouts. Ooh! We get two in the one pack! Okay. Okay. Two of them in one pack. Interesting, interesting. Obviously untradeable. Obviously untradeable. Am I gonna use either of these? This this card looks quite nice, you know. This one actually doesn't even look that bad. Yeah, honestly, this one's not bad at all. The German guy, definitely fodder. But um at least we were able to pack some of these new promo cards the first time that we've hit one, and we still have another one of these 83 times 25 remain as well. Right, last one then, boys. Then I will actually try and snipe some of these new Centurions. So, let's see what we're going to get. Hopefully, again, another big promo card. That would be nice. Striker Harry Kane. That's decent because it means 89 overall. So, there could be other very high-rated cards inside this pack. But like I've mentioned multiple times, the promos is what we're looking for. Um, Neymar, could you imagine? Neymar, bro, it'd be so good. James Milner, I'd be happy with a Liverpool card. Kimpembe as well, another 86 rated item would be crazy. What are we going to get? Come on, man, we have to get Centurions in this. Okay, okay, they're going to be on the next page if we've got any. They, they've got to be on the next page. We get quite a few walkouts. 189, 187, 286s that aren't dupes. What's going to be on the next page? Trent! Let's go, bro! Trent Alexander-Arnold! That's brilliant! I'm so happy with that, man. Let's go! I'm definitely going to play that card. I've definitely got to use him. Don't know what he's worth. 250k at the moment. Four star, four star. Yeah, let's try him out, man. I've got to try that card out. Boys, I'm really happy with that. He could be very good. He's got really nice stats across the board. I'm not going to lie. I am really happy with that, boys. That's, that's a dub, man. I'm very happy to get this. Considering it's a Liverpool card as well, it's one of the highest rated items from the promo. I think is only Neymar higher. Yeah, only Neymar is higher. So I basically, I got like one of the highest rated cards from the new promo. That's sick, man. I'm so happy with this. Hey, this new promotion and the packs as well that we saved for today have actually had a massive influence on my Road to Glory team. Again, another upgrade here, Riyad Mahrez. This is definitely a card that I want to try out. I'll pair him, of course, with Trent that we just got as well. And this should be, like, really nice upgrades. I don't think, I don't think I'm going to use the icon, Drog. He'll probably be a bench player, but it's pretty cool, though. I'm looking forward to trying out the new team. Just as an update on the RTG squad then, boys. We've actually made some changes. Mahrez and Trent both come into the team. Um, unfortunately, Drogba didn't make it, but I thought that was worth the gamble doing the pick. And the squad actually looks really good. I'm happy with this. Those new Centurions are going to be fun to use. What I'm going to do now, though, is a little bit of trading to finish out the video. Here's something interesting, lads. Ledley King's just being released as a new hero, and he's currently got a scuffed price range of like 68,000 coins max. So, apparently, he's been appearing. Let's go and try and snipe him. I'm not going to lie. 
probably not going to be able to get it as it'll be super competitive. But just even seeing this card at 68k would be pretty cool. Oh my god! I've missed one! It's real! He does appear at this price! Oh, boys! I wasn't expecting to see one so fast, to be honest with you. 67.5k! How have I gone ahead and missed it? Well, it's obvious there's some people actually trying to snipe this card right now. I'm, I'm not just going to leave it at one. I'm going to do this until I've seen a couple of opportunities. I really want to be able to snipe one. Legit, I actually want to get one of these cards so bad, but the chances are very slim. It, it's going to be almost impossible. First chance, we've missed it, but we'll carry on and let's see if we can get another. Boys, I can't believe it again, man. Are you actually kidding me right now? Another one of these Ledley King cards. I would like to snipe one of these just to see what the price range is. Obviously, 67.5 is the max. What is min? Is it going to be like 10,000 coins as well? I don't know. This is insane, though. It looks like a really good card. Obviously, it's not incredible. I'm going to assume probably around 100k. But yeah, this would actually be so cool to snipe one of these. I might even put him in the squad if I did, actually. He'd work pretty well in the team. Brother, 63,000 coins. At what stage do I stop this, boys? It's cool content, right? I do want to be able to snipe one, but I just don't think it's going to be possible. Uh, how many of these do I go for? We might finish up there. We might finish up there. This one actually under his value, which I don't understand. Why would like why would you'd compare the price for card, see there's none there, and then still undercut for his max value? Pretty insane. I might I might finish up though, boys. I don't think we're gonna put any more Deadly King snipes in. Unless I actually get one. I'm gonna I'm not gonna lie, I do wanna trade a little bit longer on this. I'm only gonna put in any more clips if I do snipe one of these cards. Right then lads, it kinda sucks that I wasn't able to actually get one of these cards on stream, but I did snipe a Ledley King at 67,500. And you know what's cool about this item? I think he's gonna go up in value, right? He'll be about 100k, in my opinion. Uh, I think it's gonna be risk-free, so if you do wanna try sniping this card as an investment, it's probably something that I would recommend. Whether, with this one item that we do have, He's going to work in the team at centre-back. And considering we've already made changes to the Road to Glory squad, may as well swap them out for Virgil van Dijk and try him in foot jumps. Anyway though lads, that will actually wrap up today's video. If you did enjoy, a like would be super appreciated. If we can it, 300 likes, that'd be insane. Other than that, do subscribe to the channel if you want you and enjoyed the content. And I'll catch you guys next time.